Hey everybody, I'm going to do a little different video uh, on this channel than normal. Uh, I'm going to show you how to get a cylinder out of an 05, uh, 06, and I believe an 07 Equinox. Uh, they're essentially just rebranded Saturn views, uh, so there's no code on the cylinder, and there's no access to the sidebar to be able to actually uh, put pressure on it to pick it to get the cylinder to turn to get it out. So what you have to actually do is drill a hole where the sidebar is to put pressure on it. And uh, so we'll do that real quick here. I'm going to use a 530 uh, drill bit. And the sidebar, we'll look at the cylinder, or the uh, whole assembly here. Uh, the sidebar goes like about like right through here, so I'm just going to drill a uh, 5 30 seconds hole right there. actually hit the sidebar so I'm going slow all right there's our hole too so we can actually uh, I don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera probably not but you can actually see the sidebar in there so you can put pressure on it uh, to be able to pick it and the other thing you need to do too uh, here's your hole to go in and eject it. Um, the way these work, you don't push straight down. Like, so it has to be turned a couple degrees, and then you have to actually push. And the retainer is actually on the side over here, so you have to actually kind of go down and then to the left to get it out. So uh, something like this actually works pretty good, but it also helps a lot to make that hole a little bit bigger. So I'm going to do that real quick with a... I think it's a 730 seconds drill bit I've got here to just widen this hole a little bit. Just makes life a lot easier. And that's really uh, all we need here, just a little more to get in there. It should be fine. Sorry guys, I'm drilling around the camera here. And then to get this out, you just need some kind of something just to be able to push on the sidebar and uh, you know you can use a rake or I've got, I've got some uh, just some depth keys here it's number four key and putting pressure on the sidebar running in and out and it's normally really easy but of course I'm doing it around the camera here so it might be a little bit harder Alright, so got in the right spot there, hit the retainer, and we got our cylinder out, and there's no code on these things whatsoever, because like I said, this car is essentially a Saturn, so the way that uh, you can make a key to it here is I'm not going to really probably be able to show on video, but I mean, you can pull it apart if you want to, um, I don't normally do that, I don't have any of these caps to replace the cap, and I don't like trying to reuse them, uh, so what I normally would do is, uh, these are just single sided locks, just put pressure on the sidebar, and when you rake it with just a rake, uh, you'll feel the sidebar drop. So right now the sidebar is dropped, so the thing is actually picked. And then when it's actually picked, you're able to actually look in this window. And I know you won't be able to see it, but you can you can actually sight read it uh, through these uh, through these windows here. You can actually sight read it, and then you have use it. If you're not real good at it, you can use a code fill program and to know if you got a valid code or not. And you cut a key. And it'll work here. Uh, it's, um, I, that looked a lot harder on camera. And it's, I just trust me, it's because the tripod's in the way. This really isn't that bad. Um, and once you make your key, you know, of course, or you know, you can even replace the cylinder if you want to, whatever you want to do. And then it only go back in in one position here. And then, you know, I'm actually not going to put it back in yet because I do want to make a key to it. But once you made your key, put it all back together, and I slap it back on the car, and it's actually pretty easy money. These actually aren't uh, aren't real hard to deal with. Um, you just have to. You know, drill your hole for your sidebar and making the hole a little bit bigger so you can actually see the retainer makes it a heck of a lot easier. So uh, if you guys have any questions or comments, uh, put them in the comments. And um, I guess, you know, if you like this stuff, uh, subscribe. And that's really all we got for now. Well, I'll talk to everybody later.